Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Renelle. <clears throat> so the video that we're going to be doing today is going to be our um, Sephora, our like. Sephora Play unboxing video. Um, this is a ten dollar a month subscription that you do get from Sephora. Um, it's ten sixty tax and all. So um, they always ship this out about the third week of the month. That's why these videos are always up late unless they sum out as PR, which I never get that. <coughs> so um, I do pay for this by myself. It comes out of my own money. Um, I don't get it for free or anything like that, like my boxy charm. So I just thought we would go ahead and do this video real quick since it's already close to the first of the month and stuff. So when you open up the box, this is what it looks like. Um, I'm sorry. This is what it looks like when you open the box. It's just, it says show off and share using Sephora Play. Um, when you open the box, the first thing that we did get was this, want to try these innovations in your life. Um, so it looks like this right here. You do get a uh, speedy points gift card gift thing when you do go inside or you can redeem this online as well. Now this tells you what you get inside the box, and this month's theme is Next Gen Beauty, so this is all the products we did get in the box. Now these are all sample sizes, they are not full size. Um, so we'll go ahead and open the bag. The first product that we actually have, um, so the first thing that I'm pulling out is going to be the Sephora Lash Craft Big Volume Mascara. This instantly amps up lashes for big volume. It says saturated black pigments plus poly polymers make lashes appear thicker and bolder. Nourishing jojoba oil seed helps prevent clumping and faking, flaking, not faking. Um, curved brush hugs every lash. Okay, so I am trying to open it. There we go, which is a lot easier now that I don't have long nails. Um, oh, this is really pretty. This is the bot the the bottle. This is the actual uh, mascara. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. It does have like a purple design on it, which is super cute. Um, so this is what it looks like. It smells just like regular mascara. I know that's super weird, but this is what the brush looks like. It is a curved brush, and this is in the color black. Now this says that it is the reason why it's trending is because this mascara creates bold thick lashes with maximum definition thanks to nurturing nurturing I'm not sure I said the word right jojoba oil which prevents clumps clumps smudges and flaking which is really good because flakes is like where it breaks off your lashes and stuff like that and it lands under your eyes and stuff and it looks a hot mess if you're not careful okay so the next thing that I pulled out is going to be the Olay Erickson Truth uh, Serum is collagen boosted with True C Complex um, it's a facial serum, and this is what it looks like. Um, this is an effective serum which formulated with vitamin C that brightens and hydrates skin. Um, so I'm trying to open this up. Oh, it's got tape on the freaking thing. I'm not on the bottom yet, don't. I don't understand that. They'll put tape on the top of it, but they won't put it in the back, like on the bottom. That's so stupid. Okay, anyway, this is what it looks like. This is a 7 milliliters, which looks like this right here. This is quite expensive. Um, I have a question. Are they on a boxy charm saver price of it? or mm -hmm, they do. This does not. Okay, so I was going to look the prices of these up, but it's kind of raining quite a bit down here, and my phone service is not very good, especially where I'm filming at. So um, I don't know how much these products are, but what I'll do is when I post focus... I'd say it's like a dollar, maybe. Oh. No, not this. This is going to be like 50. 40 or $50 more than likely. So what I'll do is I will post the price of all of these, the full size that you can get from Sephora. Um, I will leave them in the description box below, so make sure to check that out. Um, so I will have that down there when the video goes live on Monday. Okay, so the very next thing that I got that I'm very, very excited to try is going to be a sample of the Marc Jacobs Shameless. Um... What is this called? Foundation. It's foundation. For some reason, I was like trying to figure it out. Um, now, this is one that everybody has some issues with and stuff like that. I have not tried this out. 
And from all the reviews that I was, was looking at, it showed that it was either really good or really bad, but I've been wanting to try it out, but I just didn't want to spend that much for it because the closest to four to me is around a 45 minute drive. Apparently my camera cut off when I was talking and I don't know where it stopped at or anything like that. So um, again, this is, I don't know the color of this. It doesn't say. I think it's one of the, I think it's that um, I don't know. Oh, it shows that it's lights Y2 110. I don't know if that's going to be my shade or not. Um, but I will leave the price of the full size down in the description box below. Um, go ahead, open this box up. I got it. I can't do it. Oh. Oh, it's really small. Hey, yeah, this is sample size. So this is what the sample size looks like. It is in the color Y2. Yeah, it's definitely this one. One zero. Mm -hmm. That's the same color in it. Yeah. Um, this looks a little yellow tone for my skin, but I do have neutral undertones, so I am able to wear most cool or warm foundations that I want to, um, as long as it doesn't go turn like oxidized too dark on me, because I have a hard time with Cover Girl, Cover Girl foundations. They oxidize, oh my god, oxidize pretty bad on me. So I'm hoping that this doesn't. If I like this, I will buy the full size of it, even though I really hate to. But I always prefer to get a sample size of it. Even okay, so the next item that I received was the Clinique Dramatically Different Hydrating Jelly, which is this right here. This is a moisturizer. Um, it says a weightless oil-free water jelly that cures for skin's moisture barrier and protects it from pollutants. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to think of this, to be honest. I have loved Clinique stuff. Okay, so the next thing that I received was the Too Faced Hangover Replenishing Prime um, Face Primer. I've, I already have this. I have a sample size that's a little bit bigger than this, plus I have the full size of it. So I know I already love this. Um, I didn't use the sample completely up of the other one that I had, and I went out and bought the full size because I loved it that much. So I will use this. I do enjoy it. Um, again, I will leave the full size price below in the description box. This is a very, very good primer, especially because it does have coconut water in it, um, and it's silicone free. So this is very, very good for a dry skin. It's very, very Okay, so for the month's bonus, because we do get five, and then they usually send us a bonus, which is some kind of perfume or something like that. Um, this is called Tom Ford. This is Black Orchid. Um, it is like a little sample size perfume, so it looks just like that right there. Um, that right there's it. Now, the notes on this perfume is called, um, let's see. It is, the fragrance, fragrance family is floral. Floral, I cannot say that word. Floral. Floral. The top notes is black truffle. Fresh, I can't say that word. Middle notes is orchid and lotus. The base notes is sandalwood and patchouli. So it's very small, as you can see right there. I love these things because they are very, they last me a long time. So every time. Oh, I just spread that all over my hand. I love. Oh! That smells pretty good. So I just spread that all over my hands. I, I smell mine. kind of, yeah, I spread them on thin. Well, we ain't going nowhere, but we're going to smell be smelling good. Um, and I will list the full size of this price in there as well. And I will have all of these in an upcoming video. So until then, I do want to thank you all so much for tuning in. And I hope that you all have a great week. But I just wanted to pop on here and show you all my decorations in the backdrop background here. Um, this is just a few of things that I am planning on. But I hope that you all like that and that it's something pretty for you all. Um, and I will have more decorations going up. They've already got stuff out for, Hall or for Halloween, which I'm not going to do anything for Halloween. But they also already have Christmas decorations out too. So I will be buying those as well to have something pretty set up in the background just like that right there. So until the next video, I hope that you all have a great day. Bye.